Today, 4 of July, as the flags in Latvia are wearing their black mourning garments, we are commemorating the victims of genocide against the Jews in Latvia. It was 80 years ago, after the Nazi occupation of Riga, that the great choral synagogue, along with other synagogues in Latvia, were burned down, starting the first mass annihilation of Jews, which ended with 73,000 Latvian Jews perishing, together with other 16 to 25,000 Jews from other countries killed on Latvian soil. Every year in Latvia, in Greece, and all around Europe, on different dates, we commemorate six million victims of these atrocious events. We think of those who suffered in concentration camps, who were deported, killed, lost their families, their homeland, or their properties. Today, it serves as a stark reminder of our obligation to stand for what is right, to protect the vulnerable, fight the extreme ideas, including any resurgence of anti-Semitism. As Greece takes over the presidency of the International Holocaust Remembrance Alliance, the IHRA, in 2021, the Green government is deeply committed to promoting the IHRA's work, which is key to keeping the memory of the Holocaust alive. Greece and the Greek people have a strong, close relationship with the State of Israel as well. And 80 years maybe may seem to some of us a little bit too far away most of us were not even born, but it is our duty to preserve the memory, pass on to further generations, and prevent any repeat of such ideas or atrocious actions. Education is the best tool. This is why Greece has developed a special curriculum in the school programs to teach about the Holocaust. Last year, Esther Cohen in Greece was the oldest Greek Jew Holocaust survi survivor to die. In one of her latest interviews, she lamented that there was no relative of her alive to even care of her body remains after she had died. All my relatives have long perished. I will die and no one will be left to care for my remains, she said. Esther, we assure you that we will care for your memory. We will keep it alive. We will make sure we pass on the torch even after we are gone. We will never be bystanders, nor will we ever forget.